We really are only at the surface of what it is that a binaural signal can be encoded to hold. It enables you to be in that place at that time in a way that is really, really difficult for any other microphone setup to replicate. The way we record and experience sound has evolved exponentially in recent years, and audio has become immersive in ways we never before thought possible. We're taking a deep dive into the world of binaural sound. The idea is to create an immersive listening experience, one that gives the listener a sense of space and distance in a 360 sphere. Binaural sound, or 3D audio, is a specific way of capturing or rendering audio that can deliver immersive sound. It uses the shape and mass of a human head to recreate an authentic oral experience. The main difference between binaural and the normal kind of stereo recording would be that a normal stereo pickup pattern doesn't include the human head. In binaural, we have interaural time difference and interaural level difference, which are a consequence of the head-related transfer function, which basically means that if a sound happens to my right, I will hear it first in my right ear, but it will also wrap around my head to hit my left ear. Now, all this information, including the mass of my head, my shoulders, even my beard, will affect how I localize that sound. It's a much more accurate and much more immersive 3D picture. The late 1800s was when binaural first appeared. You could hear a recording of a theatre performance that was recorded using a microphone array. People would put two speakers next to their ears and listen back, and it would be like they're in the theatre. But binaural was put on the back burner a little bit while stereo itself was being introduced. You need to have headphones on to fully experience binaural. So it kind of disappeared until technology caught up with how best to use this recording technique. Dr. George McGavin's audiobook, All Creatures Small and Great, How Insects Make the World, uses binaural recordings of insects to help illustrate his vivid exploration of the insect world. The audience or the individuals who hear this book will hear effectively exactly what I heard on that day. You really feel as if you're with me. We're here in a, a bee lab because this is about the only place I would be guaranteed to get bumblebees flying around my head, which is what I really want. In we go. So this is how it works. I'm gonna put the right microphone, which is on here, in my right ear, and the left one, of course, on this side. So now I can record in binaural. is an immersive music producer, sound designer, and composer. He has produced over 100 immersive mixes over the last three years. He's heading up the 3D audio mix of an upcoming Audible original. By the nature of the tech and the way in which this is evolving, it's all about never closing the door, uh, constantly learning. Uh, constantly evolving. It really is all about telling a story, eliciting emotions or getting emotions across to a listener. There are currently two ways to capture binaural recordings. Firstly, using in-ear microphones, the kind we saw George wearing earlier. These look like headphones and use the head of the person wearing them to capture an accurate three-dimensional rendition of what the wearer is hearing. The other is using a dummy head. This particular research model deploys four microphones per ear canal, eight microphones in total. The dummy head is the best catch-all for multiple head sizes because each human head per gender uh, and also with age, it's all different. As well as capturing audio using binaural microphones, it's also possible to render an immersive 3D audio mix into a binaural stereo file. 
When you play that binaural mix in a stereo environment, your brain fills that piece of information in quite quickly where you feel, wait a minute, there's a sound coming behind me. There's no sound coming behind you. Your brain just interprets that from a binaural signal. Sour Hall is an Audible original written and directed by Laura Kerwin-Ashman. This tense psychological horror was recorded on location at a farm in Yorkshire using the Neumann KU100. I'm not listening to you. You're just trying to get in my head. I've been inside your head since the moment you came here. They say, when an animal is scared right before it dies, the fear sours the flesh. Delicious. <laughs> Immersive audio is the current frontier, whether it's musically, whether it's with scripted drama. The future of immersive audio, spatial audio, binaural technologies is about continually pushing the boundaries of what one can achieve sonically. Humans are designed to pick up sound differences and localise sound. What binaural does is it kind of leans on how we're designed. Audiobooks are actually the perfect medium for this because it allows the technology to find its place and it allows the user to be even more immersed in what they're listening to. Binaural mixes will benefit all storytelling. It's how far down the binaural rabbit hole you want to go. 